Hey guys, Synergy here, and we are bringing you a brand new Pilot Hunt video. So, we are going to get into this gameplay for you guys, and just to explain a few different things. Um, as you know, I've been a little bit busy at the minute with the Destiny coming out and everything like that, and sorting things with the clan and playing with uh, all our friends and stuff. So, yeah, I've been a little bit slower uploading these Titanfall videos for you, yeah, so here we go, and this is going to be one of the first of many for you, yeah, and I'm going to be uploading all sorts of different content for you guys, it's going to be things like Destiny, Titanfall, Plants vs Zombies, Garden Warfare, basically I'm going to expand the range on my YouTube and just show you different games and hopefully you enjoy them. So if you say are not quite into Titanfall and you prefer something like Plants vs Zombies, I'm going to wrap that on my channel as well. <clears throat> Don't forget guys, if you do like my content, to leave a little subscribe. What I'm using in this gameplay is I am actually using free satellite uplinks, but they quickly get taken out as far as I remember. As you can see here, just hit marked the guy, right over there, and then I get double teamed, and there goes my first satellite uplink. Okay, we are moving on to satellite uplink number two. Okay, I've already been hit markered via the grenade. You can see this pilot here. What he's expecting me to do is run towards him, and you can see on the floor there one of the arc mines. I'm not going to fall for that, bro. But I am going to keep eyes on where they are on the minimap. Obviously, the satellite uplinks, they're not very good. They only ping every 10 seconds, so you do have to wait it out a little bit. And you can see I actually got taken out for number two there. So in other words, we're starting with a very bad start for us. Obviously, we're going to take that pilot there, because that's an easy kill. Another pilot on the ground. Try to double out grenade, but me Titan kind of gets in the way there going to get into my titan now. Just checking around for him, looking out for that pilot locking. He is in there. Now, unfortunately I end up with a titan right behind me just as I'm focused on that pilot there and this titan is virtually going to destroy my titan right now so well played to whoever it was. You can see my titan just got took out in one hit there somehow. So you can see I've started off with not a very good start, but don't worry guys, if you are good at games and stuff like that, you can pull it back, it's no problem. As long as you're not too far into the gameplay. There we go, we pick up a nice little double kill there, we're going to use the double art grenade because we know there's more around here. Come up the top. Now we've got quite a lot around here, there we go. Now figure that one out, I'm not sure how we didn't kill him, but fair enough. Okay, this is where they start getting a few of their titans up as well. So you can see they've got three up, we've got two. Now this is actually a party that we have gone against guys, so they are actually working together. You'll see that throughout the gameplay as well. Um, but we're a man down. Now the bad thing about this particular gameplay is whenever I got my titan up I ended up getting double teamed and stuff like that, um, however in this situation I'm in the one on one situation and you can see the titan gets taken out and then Meaty finishes him off. We got another titan incoming which is the strider, I'm just going to use that cluster straight on him, force him into the ejection, tried to get the um, gooser there but I ended up getting myself double out grenaded, got the pilot locking. So we just need to keep our eyes on where that pilot is. That's a grunt. Pilot locking again. So we know he's around here and it's going to be this window right here. Can we get the charging time? Yes we can. And we take out Vengeance 92. Pilot locking yet again. So we know there's a pilot on the outside but what we're trying to do here is just help the titans out and help to take the titans down before anything else and you can see my titan gets a uh, it looked like it got one shotted but it actually got arc cannoned off an auto titan there 
seemed unusually powerful. There's a guy down here somewhere. Question is, where is I? Okay. So all I'm doing here is I'm just playing a bit smarter than what I was doing originally, because originally I was just running around and stuff like that, not giving a crap. So this time I'm going to make it a lot harder for them to find me. And make it a lot harder for them. To beat me, as you can see. Okay, so I'm just going to jump over there and challenge that straight away, and there we go, we take him out. Titan's ready. Right, so we got our Titanfall coming in, guys, and we're just going to embark straight back in our Titan now. This is one of those type of games. Um, uh, Pilot Hunter isn't my favourite mode because you can see a lot of pilots will be on the inside, they'll be in corners and stuff like that. Basically it'll be playing a game like COD. Um, the reason of coming away from COD was for the fast paced gameplay and stuff like that, which Titanfall does offer but it's in the different game modes because Pilot Hunter is sort of your COD way of playing. go, we'll take out that one, we'll just help against this one right now. <coughs> okay, let's use the shield, so we're going to bring in the electric smoke, have a look to the left, and take his shields down. He's got the amp quad rocket at the minute, so we're just going to double team up, boom, there you go, he's got it taken out, it's going to be forced into eject. Going to find the eject and he end up with a titan right behind me as well, so we need to take another titan out. He's just put on his overcharge shields, which takes me out. I'm going to use that cluster just to effect double arc. That will disorientate him and we'll get on the rodeo as well. Okay, he's brought in electric smoke, which is a bad sign for me. But what I'm going to do is just shoot him in the back there. Hopefully somebody else can take him out. And he end up with the Titan behind me and that actually kills me. Right, so we're about halfway through anyway guys, so it's just one of those things. Um, uh, the main thing, the main advice that I can really give you on Pilot Hunter when you are playing on these specific maps, and say for example you're against a full clan who just happens to be in Titans, find places that the Titans can't get to. Say for example places high, places they can't just throw a cluster in and kill you. And obviously if you're using cards like Map Hack, satellite uplink, um, packet sniffer, stuff like that, you're going to be able to see the pilots coming for you because eventually they're going to have to get out of the titans. If they don't get out of the titans and you're ahead by even one kill, who the hell cares? There we go. So you can basically see what I'm doing there. I'm just picking off a few different pilots until I've got my Titan in. Then I'm going to use the Titan to take as many Titans as possible down. Um, when we take the Titans down, that's going to force the pilots onto ground mode, which means that we're going to have more kills. Now, unfortunately, I do end up with a pilot locking. And there you go, you can see him on that roof there, but I'm getting destroyed by another Titan at the same time. So my Titan's going to be taken out. He was going for the squeeze, but we're just going to help Jedi there with the double arc grenade. And unfortunately hit marked. That's a Spectre. There's a human. We'll just take him out. There we go. First Waylander. Another guy on the open, and we'll take out Fuzzy Coyote. That's a grunt as well. Okay, so now we're being hit markered, and you can see the guy who just taken me out. Okay, so we got our Titan ready in 15 seconds. I sort of failed the jump there and end up running into the Auto Titan, get hit markered, but I don't die, which is a good thing for me. Just gonna throw those out grenades, keep his shields down, bring in my Titan. 
Notice the pilot to my right and we'll take out Coyote again. See the scores there. 35 to 35, so it's pretty even, pretty intense. How's it going to play out? Okay, so you can see someone has dropped a Titan in as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep backing off this one because he's got a normal quad rocket. Now I'm in a 2 on 1 situation here and obviously this Strider is going to be the one who's going to be forcing himself forward. My Titan's pretty much taken out already, I'm just moving back, moving out the way. I'm going to see if we can pop off a few more shots and just get to the security of the other Titans as well. Just while I'm being double attacked and you can see how well I'm playing that there. He's not noticed me at this side. I go for the gooser, but I end up getting shot, and then I end up getting executed as I get the gooser. Well, at the end of the day, that's a kill for a kill, so yeah, we'll take that. Titan's going to be ready in two minutes, we can see a pilot that's over here and we're going to take him out, there we go, nice and easy, suitable Loki. He's going to move through the building, have a look round. Now what you'll find in Pilot Hunter is a lot of pilots will be using the perk called Active Radar Port, so they are going to be able to see you, but they've only got a limited time to actually use that, you can see me taking out Smyrna just there. Um, you will normally see it on the kill cams as well if they are using the particular perk. It is a very good perk to use if you're trying to find pilots, especially when you're running it with things like map hack. Obviously map hack will keep a constant location on where the pilots are and where the titans are. So it took a bit of a risk there just running over from the actual Titan, but we end up picking up an assist. Bring our Titan back into play. And this is such a close game. Well, it was a close game, but now we're 48 to 39 from 35 to 35. Two more kills to go. Let's see if we can finish this off. Okay, let's go for the gooser. Nope. Lost track of where that gooser kill was. Just gonna take out this random auto titan. Just take out the strength basically and we're using the electric smoke. Now we've got one more kill to go. There's a guy up there, we're going to use the cluster and that should get the game women in kill on Vengeance92. So there we go guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you do like my content and stuff like that, you can see it's a high ranks gameplay so it's obviously going to be a little bit longer and I just end up ejecting on that one. My plan was to actually gooser him in the air while I did that. Unfortunately when he ejected it just took me down. But we'll take him out there, that's Animon. And as we go in for the Titan, I believe I actually get shot around here somewhere. You see Fuzzy Coyote just over there. And there we go. That was me thinking it was me on Titan. <laughs> and just to show you the scoreboards there, guys. And all I can really say is peace out for now.